much that I got by mouth. <laughs> Hey, we're here at Bike Night, Marionville Power Sports, MPS. Um, you know, let me give you a little background on what we're doing here. Um, see, we're gonna go up and ride with our good little buddy, Mini Mac. Um, been wanting to do that for at least six or nine months now, get up there and rip it up in his backyard sanctuary. So, we're on the way from Missouri to Northern Indiana and um, you know, we're just, or Oklahoma, Northern Indiana. We're making a quick stop in Missouri. This is where, um, this is where my dad used to live. Um, this is the bike shop he used to own. Um, MPS, it used to stand for Mac Power Sports. Um, he kind of got in some trouble and financial trouble and they ended up changing the name, new owners, whatever. But uh, still good people down here. You know, these are the, 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 the shop that gave me my first bikes and helped me out originally. So, you know, Kind of go, come home, visit my pops, hang out at my old local turf, you know, see some old friends in the dealership. So, um, yeah, we decided to stop by for bike night. Well, I had to bring the cooler full of cold. All right. I don't think it's because he's lazy. He's probably just beating his pecker or drinking Bud Light or something. I don't know. Probably. What's his name? Landon. Landon, you suck. <laughs> it's not bad. It really is. It's like vanilla PBR. That could be a new flavor. It should be a new flavor. Look how foamy it is. I cream and beer. <laughs> This is old school. I haven't done this in a while, actually. It's old acoustic. Oh. <laughs> I wish it wasn't chopped with a couple of thumb off. That's a good thing. That's a hell of a cut. Hey, man. It's all, it's all, it's all day's work, man. Ain't no thing. Now you can uh, you can clone Ron now. You got his DNA. Oh, yeah. thank God. That's a, that's a bleeder. Man. Yeah, I was gonna have it signed, but there I think this is all I need. All right. Uh, Those are brand new tires too. Yeah. <laughs> just, just pick this thing up. Right yeah, right, take it to just take a knobby off. Yeah, and why not? <laughs> Gross. You know, it's no wonder why they made them green, right? Cause what? It makes you want to puke when you look at them. <laughs> Oh man. Yeah, you know, how badass would that be if I had me a little gun rack on the back of the Screaming Eagle? Especially in fall during deer season. Blast the berm, berm blasting. Oh, here's a buck. Oh, six or nine pointer. Back to berm blasting. Yeah, that'd be cool. Oh god. Disgusting. Can't even believe they let four stroke motorcycles like exist. It's like electric. Let's teach kids really young to be. Let's just teach them real quick. You know, what are we gonna do next? Start feeding our kids Bud Light? Now, this one would be for a stud. You know, this is something that. I'm just gonna come out and say this is something that uh, little Ronnie, when I was little Ronnie, I would have been just. Blasting this baby, air wheeling, and all the cool things on it. How much you think this thing is? I had a, I had an idea. It'd be cheaper than sixty nine hundred. It's gotta be. I mean, I'm pretty much rich now, aren't I? I don't know. We can ask Casey, right? I'll tell you what would be a badass deal. We're going up to visit the Mini Mac, and I'm thinking like, oh man, how badass would it have been if I had this bike when I was when I was six or nine years old and freaking burn blast in the backyard. I need to. Duh, Ronnie. 
Mini Mac's six or nine years old, and he's burn blasting on a piece of shit KTM. It's like six or nine years old. Thing sucks. I was talking to his dad the other day. He's texted me on the way up here, and he literally told me, he's like, we got the 50 running good, but we don't know what's wrong with the 65. It's a big old piece of shit. I'm like, yeah, it's KTM, man. I get it. I ain't gonna get the ass ass 69 up there. You gonna do it? I mean, it'd make the kid day, year, life. Yeah. I mean, and here's the thing. So I'm not gonna... If I get this kid a bike, it's not like, oh, here's a bike just for being you, being cool. No. No. Listen here, kid. I got other words I could call you, but I'm gonna say kid because that's the nicest thing I can... Listen here, little butt licker. You're working for me now. You're in under the Ronnie Mac 69 umbrella, and I expect one YouTube video every month out of you. And then I'm gonna end up making money off him. You know, that's all part of my plan. Me scamming this kid into thinking I'm giving him a bike, but I'm actually just making profits, and I own everything. Yeah. There's no uh, child labor laws. Yeah, no child labor laws. I'm going to have him working for me every day. He's going to be out there burn blasting. He's like, oh, this is fun. But in the back of my mind, I'm going, ah, slave labor. I love it. <sighs> what this country needs more of. Exactly. Working kids, not kids jerking off on TikTok. Gross. Well, load her up. Well, we got to. Well, should we just take it? <laughs> yeah, no one's looking. That. Make me a mini Mac. Spent all day and night putting that work in just so we could ride and show I'm in. It's a one of five just so I could say we got that mini scream when it go, mini scream when it go, ride like evil can evil. But on a screaming Nico What in the hell is going on there, son? Shit! Dad, I'm building me a screaming eagle. And you're just in time for the best part. <laughs> yeah. Oh. Jeez. shit we could have done with one of these back in the day. I mean, God, I'd have been better than all of them. Oh, hell yeah. They couldn't pass you before with this. You'd be lapping them time after time. I know, Dad. You you need another beer? I, oh, hell no, I yeah. Need, I need one. <laughs> Where, you took my beer. Huh? Okay. Oh, well, that's better than a little bit of a test jump for you bring this thing up to Mr. Minimac. <laughs> 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 